In this video series, we will calculate quantities using Revit model. Please subscribe our channel for future updates. We will calculate quantities from a Revit structural project we made in our other video series. Link to a sample structural project is attached in the description. We will calculate the quantities of concrete and steel in structural foundations. We will go to view ribbon. Now click on this drop down button and click on schedule quantities. Now from the list click on structural foundations. Here we have a lot of fields related to structural foundations. First of all, select family and type. Now select type mark. Now we will select count field. Next is length of foundation. Then width of foundation. Finally, thickness of foundation. After dimensional properties, we will select volume of concrete and estimated reinforcement volume. Now press OK. Revit has displayed the fields of foundations we selected. In this table, we have type mark, count, length, width, thickness, and volume of concrete and steel. In the properties panel, we can change the properties of this table. Now let's sort this table. Select type mark. Now uncheck this itemize every instance. To hide repeated information, this table shows 8 F1 footings. We will hide this type mark field. We can see that the volume field is displaying quantity of 1 footing. We will change this field to total concrete volume of footings. Click on formatting. Select volume field. Change this field formatting to calculate totals. Similarly, change estimated reinforcement volume field. Now we can see that total concrete and steel volume are displayed in the table. Now we will place this foundation estimation table on the sheet. From the project browser, select this table from schedule quantities list. Drag and drop on sheet. Now our foundation schedule is ready. It describes foundation type mark, count, length, width, thickness, concrete, and steel volumes. In our next video, we will calculate structural column quantities. What do you think about the video? Let me know in the comment section below. Thanks for watching.